Here's Johnny. But what I do have are a very particular set of skills. Go ahead. Make my day. Keep the change, you filthy animal. I love the smell of night pump in the morning. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I break your concentration? And like that, he's gone. Today is a day for five second tips. My filmmaking list just got a quick tip about audio. So here's something for all of you actors. Staple your resume to the back of your headshot or have your resume printed on the back of your headshot. You may think it's a small thing, but believe me when I say that it irks casting directors, directors, and producers to no end when they have to match up a stack of resumes to a stack of headshots. No matter how organized you are, they will not be. Your materials are going to be stacked, unstacked, put into piles, pinned onto boards, and dozens of other things. Having your resume separate from your headshot is a giant pain in the ass. So spend some time neatly cutting it down into 8 by 10 size to match your headshot. Or go on Amazon and look up 8 by 10 resume paper. They have this on Amazon.com. Then put one staple in each corner and stick that thing to the back of your headshot. Separate resumes and headshots makes you look totally amateur. Take five seconds to step up your game and make that casting director's life a little bit easier. Remember, if you want to learn how to make better films and act on camera, Guerrilla Film School has got you covered. We put together a free training video on how directors and actors can work together on set. You can get instant access to this free training right now by going to guerrillafilmschool.com slash training. He's gone. Mm -hmm.